Hey friends, this is just going to be a short video today to show you how we do a super cheap date night in. So I stopped at a grocery store that I don't normally shop at because they're usually a little outside of our budget, but when they mark down their seafood, they mark it down at really good prices. So I'll show you what I got in just a moment and what we cooked. Yes, he likes to be tucked in and that is where he will probably stay for the entire rest of the afternoon. So we are going to have a nice seafood dinner at home for less than $10. So I got a little over a pound of some citrus herb salmon. It was marked down to $2.99 a pound. So it was just a little bit over a pound and it was only $3.62. I also got this Asian sesame salad kit with the $3 off sticker. It was only a dollar. And because I think these salad kits are delicious, but kind of sad as far as how much greens and veggies they include in them. I also picked up this giant container of greens and with the $3 off sticker, it was $3 and this is so much. We'll be eating this for the next several days. The lemon was actually probably the most expensive item as far as, you know, it wasn't a discount or anything. I spent 69 cents on the lemon. I've got some oil heating in a cast iron on the stove. Andrew has already started some rice for us. Um, we used a cup of rice, so that means that we spent 25 cents on rice for this dinner. This salmon is already pre-seasoned and ready to go. They do have skin on, which Andrew's not a fan of, but I love the skin, so I'll just eat his skin for him. All right, I think my pan is hot enough, so I'm going to lay these salmon in. I'm going to leave these alone for several minutes to cook so that way the skin can get nice and crispy and when they're cooked about two thirds to three quarters of the way up, I'm going to flip them over for the last minute or two. While the salmon's cooking, get our salad together. I'm going to put a nice handful of these other salad greens in there. Even when I add a bunch of extra salad greens, they always add enough dressing to these things that it still ends up being a well-dressed salad. So if you get one of those salad kits and it's just like it's not enough for your family, just toss some extra salad greens in it. It'd be good. Sticking just a teeny little bit, but otherwise it came off the pan nice and easy, and it's a nice crispy skin. All right, and that only took about a minute or so. I'm gonna get this off the heat so my salmon doesn't overcook. All right, y'all, here is what our completed dishes look like. Remember, this was less than ten dollars for these two meals. I mean, we wouldn't be able to go out and get salmon dinner for that cost ever. So, you know, it's you can definitely eat really wonderful meals on a budget, especially, you know, celebrate special occasions, all that without breaking the bank. All I can say is get to know your local stores, even the ones who you might think are outside your regular budget. Keep an eye out for those specials, for those markdowns, and, you know, just get as creative as you can, be adaptable, and, you know, look for those opportunities to really enjoy your food. We'll give you all a taste real quick before we uh, go sit down and eat our date night dinner together. Very, very good color. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, good enough to fall apart. Mm. Really good. Part of mine fell in my salad. <laughs> nice acidity. And that skin is so good and crusty. I think salmon and just a plain white rice is one of my favorite combinations. That's right. We were supposed to be tasting it so we could go sit down together. <laughs> well, that's what we're doing. We're right here now. All right, y'all, we really are going to go sit down and enjoy our meal together, but I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see y'all next time.